a good win tonight. Um, you know, Josh Allen, it was vintage Josh Allen tonight. I mean, he was he was playing about his confidence. You can play as a quarterback. You know, what was your assessment on how, how he played tonight? Uh, I honestly think, and as you hit it, I mean, Josh, Josh was uh, ex extremely comfortable. Uh, we gave him a lot of time in the pocket, and uh, Josh stood there and got the ball where he needed to go. You say you gave him a lot of time in the pocket. There, he had a lot of time. At one yeah. point late in the game, I think he had only been hit three times. You did, were you guys? Did you guys feel like the ch the challenge was in front of you because the Niners have a nice front? You know? Did yeah. You I feel I like. Mean, I mean, it's 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 a it's a it's a it's a teeter top totter thing. Like uh, like on one of those plays, I had messed up, and Josh was standing there like like real confident. And uh, shoot, I wish that he would have threw that ball out but hey I mean it's never perfect but 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 um and the good thing is is that coming in in a game we like we said that we need to get give Josh time so we can get the ball where it needed to go and that's what uh we came in here and did so uh never really like satisfied but I'm happy that and we got number nine all right hey safe travels back man take care yeah. thank you bro Good. I don't think nobody wants to talk to you. Hey, Deanna, Stuart in the bar room. Uh, com. How's it going? Well, what's up, man? Uh, it's Monday Night Football. It's Josh's childhood team. Do you sense he embraces that, that moment or the stage, or is it business as usual for him? Uh, I think Josh loves the hype, and I think that he he loves to uh, to to show people the the – the truth. I mean, like people always doubt and people always uh, want to criticize and say, you know, just bad things. But um, Josh, Josh, Josh is one of those guys that's built for the big moments, and uh, he just continues to show it um, prime time after prime time, big game after the big game. But it all circles back to just keep your business as usual, and uh, your play will show for itself. I just want to ask about Cole Beasley. It seems like he sets new marks every week. Just what kind of presence is he? Incredible presence. Cole Beasley, to me, like his presence is is like is like a superhero, and he reminds me of the, the Flash. Like, like he's uh, extremely quick, and he's just uh, he's just like not a little kid, but he's just like a go getter. Like he's out there, but he has fun. He uh, and he says his little comments, and he just goes he goes hard. Uh, at 150 miles per hour, and, and uh, he just continues to do it over and over again. And uh, when I see him, I see the flash. I appreciate it. Safe travels, man. Yeah, thanks, bro. Hey, Dion, it's John. Uh, you, you mentioned how Josh really likes to be in the spotlight, and, and it's driven by proving the people wrong that have doubted him. What about this team as a whole? Do you guys relish this spotlight and a performance like this on this type of a stage to once again show that, that this team is not the Bills that people knew uh, in the past? Yeah, uh, I mean, like it just comes from us keeping it personal that we need to win on every stage and uh, continue to grow and grow and grow and grow and grow and grow. So when we have like prime prime time games, uh, it's it's nothing different. It's it's the same thing. No hiccups. No 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 drastic change. And uh, that came from time of being in positions like like this. And uh, Josh is our leader, and he continues to show out on uh, prime times and practice on non prime times. He just does what he does. Appreciate it, man. Have a safe trip. Thank you, John. Dion, it's Jason Wolf with the Buffalo News. Congratulations up, on the win, man. How are you? Thanks, brother. I'm I'm very good. I'm good. We got a win. Can't be more happy. I got you. It was a good win, man. Were you aware uh, before now that uh, the Steelers lost tonight and are no longer undefeated? Uh, I didn't know. So uh, and the Steelers lost. So what, so what was the uh, the final score? The the Steelers lost to Washington. It was close. It was by six points. Okay. 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 Well. Uh, I, I, you, you, right, yeah, man, it's football. You got a short week to get ready for a team that, that you thought was undefeated, that was the last undefeated team in the league. Now they're coming into your house. 
uh, was curious what you thought about how their loss might change the dynamic of this game and, and you guys week ahead. I mean, honestly, man, honestly, Jason, um, I don't even want to think about the Steelers yet. I just want to enjoy this win. I uh, have a couple more hours to uh, let this one sit in, soak in. And uh, if you can ask me tomorrow or the day after, I'll be happy to talk about the uh, Steelers then. I got you, man. Enjoy this one. This is your yeah, first win. It. This is the Bills' first win on Monday Night Football in more than 20 years. What do you make of that? I mean, like that just shows what the uh, what the guys like upstairs did. They uh, and they put a good group of guys together uh, to continue to put themselves in positions to win. Uh, nobody's perfect, but uh, we just find a way to just come together and get the job done. But uh, I give all of the credit to the people like upstairs, Bean, you know, the Pagulas. McDermott, like all of those guys that have put a great team in place to uh, win in situations such as this. Kind of an odd situation with you guys going back to Arizona to play this game after what happened a few weeks ago. How does it feel to walk off the field this time with a W? It feels good, man. Uh, anytime you can uh, get a win, it's special. It's extremely hard to win in this league, and we don't take any win for granted. But uh, we're just happy to leave Arizona with, with a W in this time instead of an L. Appreciate you, Dion. Congrats, man. Gotcha, Jason. Yep, thank you, man. All right, you're good to go. Thank you, Dion. Gotcha.